Looking for a great location, half an hour to pretty much everything. I've got a beautiful single story, four bedroom, three bathroom home to show you today. Let's have a look, let's go. Hello and welcome to another episode of Orlando Home Show where strategy matters, passion rules and today's video is sponsored by Nick Long of AmeriFirst Home Mortgages, NMLS ID 398-963. Now guys, today I am in Kissimmee and I'm in the part of Kissimmee that is pretty much half an hour away from everything. Half an hour to the airport, half an hour to Universal, SeaWorld, Disney and to downtown Orlando. A perfect location. I've got a beautiful four bedrooms, three bathroom, about 2,108 square foot home built by DR Horton in a brand new community. And they're gonna have their own Publix and their own kindergarten to eight schools. So the first thing that I want to point, mention to you is you get these beautiful pavers up front and then you have this porch area right over here. Now guys, keep in mind that the builder has about three to four different elevations. So if you don't like this pattern, they also have an elevation that you can have stone. So let's go in and check this. But I also like that you have the extra lights over here. And this is a three car garage with a separate bay. And as I walk in, you have this covered little area, which I always like because uh, these days we get a lot of packages from Amazon, FedEx, whatever it is, but your kind of packages pushed in the house so if it's raining, it's kind of protected to a certain extent. So let's go in and check this beautiful house out. Hey guys, so I am in Kissimmee and the price of this house is in lower fours. You can actually build this exact house for about 420 plus the lot, which is anywhere between five to $10,000. Now guys, if you are looking to buy and you are in the 350 to about 500, it's getting very, very difficult to find good homes in great locations. So I'm gonna suggest you to come down, you know, come on down, let me show you around. And if you're three months, six months or 12 months out, you want to start the process now because the prices are still escalating. So you want to make sure that you can lock in the price or at least get something. So I'm in a community built by DR Horton. And by the time they are going to be done with it, it's gonna be at 3,200 homes uh, located right off uh, the 192 area. And you're pretty much close to a lot of things. Now, as I show you this house, everything that you see in this house, you're going to get. So the lot size is 60 by 120. Now guys, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and do so. We put in a, a lot of effort in bringing you these videos. I produce about eight, eight videos a month and I go all throughout Central Florida. So if you are looking to build a brand new home, this is a great resource. So please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. So as I walk in, the first thing that I want to mention to you is the ceiling height on this specific model is about 9.4. Things like this are pretty easy to do and I'm going to suggest that this is something you can always do that later on. But the tiles that you look at over here, uh, your baseboards, all of these things are inclusive. Now guys, keep in mind that with this builder, uh, they're kind of on a bidding system and that doesn't mean that you have to overbid what they're asking for a property. It's just that that's how they have it because in this market, Every builder is doing things very, very different. There are builders out there with escalation clause. There are builders that's gonna have you bid on the uh, lot. So there is a lot to navigate, especially in this market. And if your price point is just below 500,000, uh, you know, use our services. It's absolutely free to you. I would love to be the agent of choice to help you. So as I walk in, you have the two bedrooms right there with a bathroom. So let me go ahead and take you to one of the rooms. Now, I have always said that guys, that it's not the square footage of the house. It is the flow of the house, how well it shows. Now, this is a pretty good size bedroom with a single light. Now, if you've been watching my videos, you already know if you are going to use one of the rooms as your office, then I highly, highly suggest you to get those extra lights if you could, because that is a good upgrade to have. If you haven't watched my do's and don'ts for new builds, I would suggest that you do so. You have these double door closet, you know, just a skinny closet. It goes pretty much from this end all the way to there. 
you know i like these kind of double door closet than the sliding ones because sometimes the sliding thing it's, it's always a mess to to kind of work with so as i go down you have a bathroom to share and it is it has the two sinks over here with the granite and you can see that the the color over here is gray so they have like six different options so if you don't like this combination like this granite and then this color and this tile then they have six other options the thing with this builder is that you don't really have to go to a design center they do not have a design center what they have done is they have like six different color screens so if you like white then they have that with a different color scheme so if you want to know more make sure you put in the comment below i'll be happy to send you the info to be able to assist you a shower tub combination over here with a commode area pretty good size and as i take you around you have another bedroom over here and then it has a little walk-in closet with a nice window bringing in a lot of light so it's a good size closet right there if you look at the rooms it's only 2106 square foot but look at that I mean, doesn't it look big i have seen homes and i've shown homes that are almost four or five thousand square foot and it's like a little square and a rectangle a lot of dead space but this home is designed really well you have a beautiful arc right there and then as i go in you have the garage let me go ahead and show you because this is a three car garage and you actually have a separate bay for one car now i have had a lot of clients that have kind of used this area as a storage area and then you've used this so if you can look at the size of this garage and also this is the only builder in all of central florida that does block over block so if you buy a two-story home with them they actually do block over block and this is the only one that does that most of the builders have block on the first floor and then they have a frame on the second now you have this little station right there i've seen with pulte jones home hanover they have like a little station this is a nice cavity and you can always build a piece of furniture according to this and it could be a down station you come in you drop your keys you drop whatever you need to this could be a good and then you have a bathroom with a single vanity or a, a, a vanity with a, a single sink and then you have a frame walk-in shower with the white subway tile now this is a standard feature with this so what i am showing you is exactly what you would get and you will get the color combination if you choose that one so if you like this house and and you need more info feel free to reach out now you have another bedroom pretty comfortable size look at this now these things as i was saying this is nothing but a frame I like a little wood frame and then they painted it white and it kind of shows really well it's kind of glued and nailed into it and then you have a nice window with the double door closet as i was mentioning is something that i really like and then as i go around you also have a separate laundry area which is right around but look at this guys as i go in the house starts to open up so look at this this is your laundry area the thing about this is that it's a little bit most of the time i've seen that the laundry area is right next to the garage i prefer this option look at the size of this laundry you know it's pretty good now keep in mind guys you are not going to have the washer and the dryer included so that is something that you would have to pay on top and dr horton as a builder you know they are a production builder they do a lot of uh uh, they produce a lot of homes and um, they usually don't release it until it's three to four months out so if you are looking to move in the next four to six months then this could be a great community and i can let you know what inventory homes are available and i can show you the six different color screens that they have and you can choose and then they'll say hey we have this 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 available and this is the color scheme and if you like it you basically put forward so they first they release it as a bidding and if that doesn't go through the bidding then they put it on the market as a standard inventory home and they are paying some parts of your closing cost and it's always changing now guys don't quote me on the price or the closing cost because it is changing 
pretty much by every one or two sales. So please don't quote me on that uh, because uh, you know things are changing. And if you are in that lower price point, I would highly, highly suggest that. I would also suggest that you get yourself qualified. I have a great lender who can help you so that you are out there looking with confidence to be able to buy a house that fits your budget so you're not disappointed if you are not able to buy that house because you didn't do your homework. So I hope this makes sense. It has this little nice area like a coffee station or a bread station with this nice cabinets. And then it also has a small walk-in uh, pantry right over there with this big island and a 60-40 sink. So look at this. Now you do get the microwave and you do get your stove. So that is included. Refrigerator is not included. So keep that in mind, but you do have a dishwasher. What I also like is that you have this space. It's kind of a semi-formal, you know, uh, not exactly formal, but definitely semi-formal area. So you're right off your uh, main kitchen area for dining area, you know, with Thanksgiving coming around the corner, this could be a good option. When you have family come over, you know, you have this dining area right there. And then you also have a covered lanai area, which I'll take you out in just a moment. But look at all the space that you have. You have this family living area and look at the windows, one, two, three, four, and then the other one there. So it gives you a lot of windows. You know, I love the house when it's nice and bright. And then you have the extra recess light. Now guys, keep in mind that this is something where you cannot come and say, hey, I want this color, but then I want to change that. They're not going to do that, you know? So they are a production builder, as I mentioned, so they're just going to look into it. So just keep that in mind. So let me go ahead and show you the master bedroom first, and then I'll take you outside to the covered lanai area. So look at the size of your master bedroom with a nice small tray ceiling and a light and the big window right here bringing in a lot of light. Look at the size of it. I usually stand in the corner to kind of give you an idea how deep the room is. So you have a, a good size, um, it's a fairly big uh, side table over here and on that side too. So you have a good space. And then as I walk into your master bathroom, you have the two sinks. You have a lot of space right there. And then you have a walk-in shower with the subway white tiles over here. So you have good space with this little niche. You know, it's pretty comfortable. And then for the lovely ladies, you do have a tub. I know that is big with, with the ladies. So you do have a tub, a nice big uh, window over here that you can frost it so you don't have, you can, or you can uh, put some sort of a coating so you can see outside, but they cannot see uh, from the outside in. And then of course you have your commode area, nothing very exciting about that part. And then you have a nice size closet. It kind of goes a little bit deeper in. So let me know your thoughts, guys. Now, remember, I don't work for the builder. You can have my services for free. I get paid by the builder and I'll be happy to help you show you around and, and take you through the whole process of buying a house, which right now is a very, very challenging process because we have a lot of clients come in and right now there are more buyers then there are properties available. And because we don't have the state income tax, you know, uh, we have a lot of guys, a lot of people that are moving. So you have this porch area. Look at the size of this porch, guys. You can always get, you can always uh, cover this area and have your little thing. And then this is a builder model, but your lot size kind of goes all the way to the back. And it's 60 by 120, which kind of gives you enough space to build a pool if this is what you are looking to do. Now, again, if you are in the market and you're looking for something below 400, I'm sorry, below 500, this is a great community. By the time they're all said and done with it, they're gonna have their own school, a public. This community has great amenities. You have a community pool, you have the uh, tot lot, the dog park area, you have a fitness center, and there is a HOA and a CDD included, and they are about $181 a month. Let me know your thoughts, and if you are looking for a brand new home that won't break the bank, a three car garage, four bedrooms, three bathroom. This is a great option to look in. Uh, give us a call. We would love to be able to assist you. Until the next video, bye for now. Thank you for watching.